A group of teenagers accused of going on a violent crime spree in South Minneapolis in a neighborhood there committing several robberies, even stealing a car in broad daylight. And that is our top story tonight at 9. I'm Randy Meyer. And I'm Kelsey Carlson. Courtney Godfrey joining us live tonight. And Courtney, police say this was pretty violent. Yeah, Kelsey, one of the victims was punched in the face. The other one had their car stolen. And police say this was all done by 14 and 15 year olds. Surveillance video shows a group of six pile out of a car, hoods up, masks on, ready to commit their fourth robbery of the morning. They pushed her down and then they opened up the cash register and took the took the cash out and then ran out of there. Chad Stamps describes the moment they robbed his wife at her South Minneapolis gift store, 14 Hill, in broad daylight Tuesday. When Stamps' wife saw her opportunity, she ran next door to the dog wash business, but the suspects followed her, assaulting the employee inside. The thieves making off not only with all the cash she had on hand and her purse, but her car as well. Police saying the brazen criminals were only 14 and 15 years old and on a crime spree around the Lake Nokomis area. The, the police can only help after the fact, you know, and that's what they're doing right now. But it's not going to stop them from coming in and doing this unless you take away the source and figure that out. Police tracked the cars and three of the six were arrested, now facing multiple felony charges, while these businesses are left with thousands in loss and plenty of fear. Police telling us that in the area where those robberies occurred in the third precinct today by 4 p.m., there were already four carjackings today alone. One business owner in that block telling us he's ready to move to the suburbs. Reporting live in Minneapolis, Courtney Godfrey, Fox 9.